In this video you're going to learn how to set up a redirect link for your affiliate sites. Now if you're promoting an affiliate program, for instance let's go to the Clickbank Marketplace and we'll just pick any affiliate product when we get here. going to promote a product under the Clickbank marketplace you need to create a hop link. You have to click on create a hop link and then in here you have to put in your Clickbank nickname and then you click create. Clickbank now has created an affiliate link for you. Now the problem with this is most people are going to know that this is an affiliate link so you're going to want to hide that. Some people won't click on affiliate links or they will replace their own ID in the affiliate link to steal your commission, this being the part that they have to change. So a good way to keep that from happening is to mask your affiliate links. And it's really quite simple to do. Let's go over the process. One of the easiest ways to do this is to use a service like Pinurl or TinyURL. Just go to their site and all you have to do is enter your URL in here and then click make TinyURL. Now what it does is it creates a URL that looks like this and you can put that in there because nobody is going to know what you're promoting by looking at this. So that's the first way to do it. Just highlight it and copy it and you now have a masked link. Now another way to do it is to create a redirect that you upload to your server. Now let's have a look at how to do that. Now here's an example of a meta refresh. All you have to do is change the file and put your the URL in here that you want to redirect to. You're going to find this file in the zip file that you downloaded with the video. So all we have to do now is save this. Now when I click on redir.html, it's going to redirect us. So all you would have to do is upload this to your server, rename it to whatever you want it to be. Instead of redir, you could name it like the product name or whatever you want. Then when you direct people to that URL, they will be redirected to the affiliate program that you're trying to promote. So let's go ahead, I'll click on that and just show you what it does. Okay, so it's redirected us to our affiliate page. Now let's just go to the payment sign. Just make sure that it picked up our affiliate ID. And you can see down here at the bottom it did. I feel like it equals TJC01. So that's another way you can do it. There's one more way, and that's to use the cPanel redirect. And let's go over that now. Now I'll show you how to do it using the cPanel. Just log into your cPanel, and on here somewhere you should see redirects. Click on redirects, and all you have to do is put a suffix on after your domain name in a spot here. So let's just say whatever the product name is you put here, or anything you want. I'm just going to call it redirect. Now you paste your affiliate link over here. Now make sure that you take the HTTP colon slash slash off the front because it's already implied as you can see here. So, all we have to do now is click Add. And you can make it either a temporary or permanent redirect. This is for search engines, so it doesn't really matter which one you pick, but we'll just leave it at temporary. I'll click Add. Now, if we were to take this, and we'll copy this, and I'll paste it into the browser bar and then this should redirect us to our affiliate page. As you can see, it did just that. Now, we'll go down to our where we pay and we'll go and make sure that it picked up our affiliate link. And it did. As you can see down here, it 
code has our affiliate ID in there. So that's three easy ways you can use to mask your affiliate link.